Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting bring to episode 8 of season 2 of a regular at Magic High School. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Alright, I mean, is Lena gonna kick Tatsuya's ass after he <laughs> the ish of what happened last week? Honestly, I don't know. Because girl, <laughs> and boys, but girl. <laughs> My best girl, my husband. Mm. You're right about that, though. I know, because you didn't want to see it. I know. You don't want to leave him. Oh, we know. We know. <laughs> Y'all didn't have to start the episode like that. Y'all just wanted to. <laughs> I can't with these two. Ha <laughs> ha I don't even know what to say. Thank you for starting out that way. That's all. my heart I just can't <laughs> that was just too much How you doing, Pixie? Really? Makes sense.
so in a way you almost need it like to live and also to control that body yeah So you basically just killed the soul of the body? Yeah, so that's what you're saying. Of course. So then it's possible, okay, let's just say another parasite is around. Shit, okay, no, never mind. Because I'm thinking, okay, then she could possibly sense one. Are we going into cult shit now? Uh, um, okay. There's no way. I Are you serious? All but one woke, though. But why didn't that one wake up? Because that missing comrade is inside Pixie? God. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yes, she's an android, but still. <laughs> we know that, but she's still a girl. She's still a girl. You need to go. <laughs> Yeah, this is an awkward now. Hanukkah, you look cute too. I love your jacket. <laughs> Someone's jealous. Okay. No. <laughs> I 
Erica is me. Like, oh my god. <laughs> Lena? No. Let me get Lena? I don't know. Oh shit. <laughs> Thought you would have brought your brother with you as well. Her voice is familiar. I can't figure out who it is. No! Hold on. Is that Maya? Maya's voice? I'm not talking about Maya the character, I'm talking about Maya the actress. <laughs> Well, you have no choice but to take it. I mean, you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't. Hmm. Of course, I still fucking watch in his eyes. I honestly thought they weren't going to be able to identify Pixie, but of course. What do you sense? for should you split up oh <laughs>
I'm guessing she has to be, right? So you can sense them. Oh, damn, I thought Pixie was going to fight, too. See, you say that, and... Not pixie. And give it to that one guy, right? But that's not right, though. Do you want to go? So there's her answer. So no, you can't take her. Really, it's Hanukkah. about that. No, but... Get that. Exactly. So that also means that you don't really care, though. Oh. 
Okay, go ahead with your knives and try. I mean, y'all think that's gonna work? No! No! So no matter what, that body's still gonna die. Did they just become one? Because of her light? I mean, there was already one last week, so... Are you kidding me? So we, we, I gotta wait till next week for y'all to explain that ish. I mean, yes, we know her ish is light, but did, did Honoka's feelings also go back into, into Pixie again? And how she wants to, you know, be useful and protect Tatsuya? Cause yes, I get it. Tatsuya, a fine ass man. We know. Boy, man, he a man. He a man. He's a man. He fine. Ish, that I'm just saying, but because of the fact is literally every girl is in love with him, including myself, but she just wants to protect him, like, oh, um, don't like Marty and the other parasites, fuck them, <laughs> like, that ass, like, you just want to punch them in the mother effing face, I, I, mm, that ending, that little, that last little bit, explain that but of course we gotta wait until next week for that to be explained which i hate because i really wanted to be next week or next week now because each episode for this show and so good it ends with me wanting more and then i'm like bruh i kind of wish like and see this is why i'm so glad that i was able to watch season one on netflix so that i could have just binged it all and then i did that video and asking any question that i was able to ask and then anyone who came in and said something was able to say something but with this because it's week it's bi-weekly and we don't get every answer until the following week unless you're someone who has read the novels and you know everything but still you know like honestly i need some context on that last little bit but it has to be the fact is honoka wanting to protect him and her feelings of him still going into pixie and portraying for that and her light you know not only protecting herself but also protecting pixie who knows? I mean, hopefully we get a little bit more on that next week. But yeah, I mean, I love the fact that still Honoka is getting a lot of development in this because in season one, her and Shizuku were like this. 
they were barely they were getting episode development and like screen time and such to the point where they were like I think by the end of season one they were more like background characters like they're still main characters but they're like main background like they're still there just to be in the background for like a second and then maybe to have a voice but the fact is that like now Honaka is getting more of that screen time to be a little more developed because this season really is focusing a lot more on her than season one I love that it's good still like uh I can't you just you had to start with that now the child the girl who I think Maya what's her face is voice acting bruh like I still can't believe they will like this girl is like what 10 years old maybe 12 13 and you have him this child that uh, one of the heads of the family to be the one who comes and has an adult conversation with someone like the colonel or, or anything I mean I get the ish um that Miyuki is in and why she's so afraid of wanting to be the head of Yosuba because if she is that's basically her you know not having the relationship with her brother anymore and I I hate that I want them to stay together I mean I didn't know we're we're not going to talk about that we're not going to talk about that because there was one thing I got spoiled on and I'm not going to say it until we get to the end of the season but if you know you know if you don't I ain't gonna say anything until we get to the end, but still, like, oh, God, the fangirl moments between these two, I can't, I love them so much, but this is a really good episode. Just want to know what the hell is gonna happen next, that's all, just give me that, that's all I want right now, but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode eight of season two of A Regular at Magic High School. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel, I make videos every single day, join the Magic Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode nine. Bye, guys.